Susan B. Anthony. We'll be looking in depth at the courageous efforts and attributions to the women's suffrage movement. With the ratification of the 19th Amendment in 1920, women were granted the right to vote, but it took a lot to get there. In 1852, Susan B. Anthony joined the women's rights movement. She believed that women deserved the right to vote so that they could influence public affairs. Ignoring opposition and abuse, Anthony traveled, lectured, and canvassed across the country for the right to vote. Susan B. Anthony was arrested for voting in the 1872 presidential election for the fact that she was being then and there a person of the female sex. She was tried and convicted in June and sentenced to pay on a $100 fine and court costs. Anthony said in court, I shall never pay a dollar of your unjust penalty, and never did. Susan believed that no self-respecting woman should wish or work for the success of a party that ignores her sex. Before retiring, Anthony was asked if all women in the United States would ever be given the right to vote. She replied by stating, it will come, but I shall not see it. It is inevitable. She pushed reforms for women's rights all the way up to her death in 1906, just 14 years before the 19th Amendment was ratified. Without Susan B. Anthony's efforts, who knows how long it would have taken for women to get the right to vote.